Hello everybody and welcome back to Mr. Tom Teaches Again. Today we're going to talk about comparing fractions. To be specific, comparing dissimilar fractions. Before we get started, let's remember what a fraction is. A fraction shows us a part of a whole or a part of a set. The number on the top, the numerator, shows how many pieces we are talking about. The number on the bottom, the denominator, shows how many pieces in total. Sometimes fractions have the same denominators. For example, one-fourth and three-fourths. Those are called similar fractions. They're super easy to compare, add, or subtract. But what if you have one-fourth and one-third? What? The denominators are not the same. Dissimilar fractions have different denominators. So what do you do when you want to add, subtract, or compare fractions with different denominators? Step 1. Find the common denominator. Step 2. Change each fraction so the denominator is the same. Step 3. Now compare or add and subtract. Let's find a common denominator for one-fourth and one-third. The common denominator is a number that both four and three can divide into. We list our multiples for four, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty. For three, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Twelve is the least common multiple, or LCM. To make fractions similar, we make the denominator the least common multiple. Since 4 goes into 12 three times, we multiply the numerator and the denominator by 3. 1 times 3 equals 3. 4 times 3 equals 12. 1 fourth equals 3 twelfths. Now, let's look at the denominator of 1 third. 3 goes into 12 four times. So we're going to multiply the numerator and denominator by 4. 1 times 4 equals 4. 3 times 4 equals 12. 1 third equals 4 twelfths. Now we can compare. We look at the numerators. 3 twelfths, the same as 1 fourth, is less than 4 twelfths, the same as 1 third. So 1 fourth, or 3 twelfths, is less than one-third, or four-twelfths.